Hello everybody. We are from Gokraj Rangaraju Institute of Engineering and Technology. I am Pavitra. My team members are B Kirti, B Jhansi, A Ramya Shri. Here is our project on XML keyword search. We have completed this successfully under the guidance of Associate Professor P Varaprasad Rao sir. Generally, we search data from database where we need to know the query language. For a user friendly environment, a project uses a search technique by just asking a keyword. The extreme success of web search engines make keyword search the most popular search model for ordinary users. As XML is becoming a standard in data representation, it is desirable to support keyword search in XML database. It is a user friendly way to query XML databases since it allows user to post, post queries without the knowledge of complex query languages and the database schema. Inspired by the great success of information retrieval style keyword on the web, keyword search on XML has emerged recently. Maintaining a database is a complex job and it is costly. To reduce it, we have implemented this so that our databases can be converted into XML and it makes the search easier. Steps involved are creating XML dynamically from a SQL Server database or access existing files. Search for tag, tag values, tag attributes, tag attribute values. Provide search using direct search with no ambiguity. Search using via search address ambiguity. Rank database on specific or matching value followed by combined values and then followed by non-matching values. This is a sample code where EMP number is an element, department is an attribute, admin is an attribute value, 7369 here is an element value. Search in XML files. The module prompts the user with an XML file whose contents need to be searched. The user is asked for the keyword to be searched, the match matching pattern where, the expect, where he expects it to exist. The pattern may be one of the following. A tag, a value, an attribute and an attribute value. The model checks for ambiguity and displays the data, data in tabulated form. We face ambiguities like a keyword can appear both as an XML tag name and as a text value of some other nodes. A keyword can appear as the text values of different types of XML nodes and carry different meanings. A keyword can appear as an XML tag name in different contexts and carry different meanings. Here is ranking data which is used to resolve these ambiguities. Suppose a keyword query chess is issued to search for students interested in hobbies Ideally, the system should rank students who do have chess in their nested interest nodes before who do not have. Moreover, it should give student A who is only interested in chess a higher rank than another student B who has many interests including chess. Hardware requirements are P4 or higher processor is required, 512 MB RAM, 10 GB space of hard disk and software requirements are Windows 2000 or higher version of operating system Frontend is frontend.net, vb.net, rdbms or backend is ms access or sql server. We use vb.net for, for our execution. Here goes our execution. task for the user authentication where we type our user ID and password. We also have a reset password button and sign in button. We have three options here. They are XML options, search and exit in our menu bar. In XML options, we have create XML and view XML. Now let us see what create XML is. Here we convert a database file into XML file. We give our system name database username and database password. We browse our database name that is display. In display we have many tables like coding, designing, etc. etc. Here we need to give a query. Select star 
from one of the files from display database that is testing and the XML file name with which we are about to save our file we are saving with a nine with a name testing code XML created successfully let us view the XML which we have created just now our file name is testing code XML the vi visible file is our file which we have just converted it from database file to XML file now we have different search techniques those are direct search via search and ranking this is a direct search here we browse a file that is e AMB1 open our file and we are searching with a tag value let us view in a browser we have address as a tag now let us search with address ADDR we are given Sikandrabad which is a tag value for the given selected tag and we select it as a value we, we do the same thing with value attribute and attribute values which are all available in our HTML or XML XML file created this is via search where we resolve our ambiguity let us see AMB1 the same file what we have seen just now here is a tag value address when we search it gives many many data large data which is found in the same which is found in different tags we need to give a tag name which we specify for required tag and continue the search to resolve our ambiguity here we got data Secunderabad Hyderabad with same tag name s name s name let us see an ranking search we are taking the same file or the other file rank.xml we are viewing in this we have hobbies as a tag and hobby as a sub tag let us search now parent tag is our hobbies hobbies and ra we rank it based on hobby of each student and value is chess let us rank it when we view in our browser chess is played by some students caroms is played by some students and football is played by some students let us see the see uh, particular students who play only chess and rank accordingly here we ca we have akash cse which is an exact match who plays only chess and raj it let us see that akash he play he is in cse and he plays only chess he has no other hobbies and Raj who has chess cricket and football as his hobbies let us see that Raj has man many hobbies similarly with Arun, and Arun CSE and Arjun CSE they do not have chess as their hobby as we can see it here and all the we have rank list where we have all the all the list depending on who uh, depending on ranking where we have who play chess as the first rank and who play chess including other games as the next ranks and who do not play chess as the later ranks and we exit the file thank you 
kind of information. This can be applied for non-confidential data like bookstores, libraries, etc. Thank you.